Good morning. This is Carleen, and I have a concern for our young people and the image that they are projecting to society these days. Now, I was young many years ago. I won't say how many. I was a spring chicken at some point in my life, and I enjoyed being trendy and stylish and everything with my friends. But now, what is going on with these booty shorts that these young ladies are squeezing themselves into, laying down on the bed to zip and button? Your pants cannot be comfortable in the least. They are tight. They are extremely revealing not discreet in any form or fashion and I'm sorry but my circulation throughout the extremities of my body that's a very important thing for me I must not experience the whole pins and needles issue when I take my clothes off they leave marks on your body this is a sign people that these clothes are entirely entirely too small now, having said that, I understand. I'm with you ladies on being attractive and wanting to impress your man and expressing your own individualism and whatnot. Now, I adore a nose ring. Adore. And if it weren't for my husband, I'd have one. I would. I'd have had one five years ago. But that man would throw me out. He would put me on the street. But I love me a nose ring. And also, well, I just might have a couple little discreet and small hidden tattoos from my younger years. And I use them as reminders since I have a not so great memory these days of years gone by and the times that I spent with my friends and 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 they are symbols to me and for me of the life that I've lived it's good to enjoy your youth it is a wonderful thing and I am all about expressing myself and I have learned throughout the years that I should have enjoyed my youthful body more than I did because in all honesty ladies and gentlemen your body that you have right now at age 18, 19, 20 is not gonna look like that when you're 38, 39, and 40. Let's just face it. Reality is just reality. And you are going to experience some sagging and some loose skin and, and, and the, you know, muffin top and, and all this. And just wait until you have children. When the babies get here, your body it's just not going to be what it used to be. So please enjoy yourselves. But we don't really want to see your undergarments. Gentlemen, that brings me to my next point. What is really going on with these oversized shorts and pants and clothing that these young men are carrying around because there's no way that you can actually wear these articles of clothing because they are tremendous. Fall five size is too large. They are falling off. Could we compromise somewhat in this dressing area, ladies? Loosen up your shorts. Have some dignity, 
Show some discretion, for Pete's sake. Gentlemen, even though your friends are, uh, and I think there's even a song, something about pants on the ground, some such nonsense. This is an issue. Because what if you forget to put on your underwear one day and your pants fall down and you are walking down the street and all of the sudden your butt is exposed to the world. Now people, that is completely unnecessary and it is unattractive and we don't need, we don't want to see this on a daily basis. I don't ever want to see it again in my life to tell you the truth again comfort comfort is the key please let's all be comfortable show some discretion with our choice of apparel and we'll all live happily ever after now y'all have a nice day